city with yeah, my yeah, baby yeah. Uh, to change this world. Yeah. But the truth of the matter is, is, do you know what time it is? All right. Yeah. Hmm. Ask your neighbor, neighbor, neighbor. neighbor. Oh, neighbor. Oh, what time what is it? Time is it? Time. Mm. It's Boy, time God. to change the world. But the best way that we can change the world is what? Prayer. Prayer. We got to change ourselves <laughs> through confession. We got to change ourselves through confession, which gets us to point number two: the confession to the master. And this was time. This was time for freedom to to go back to the promised land. It was it, it was time to be liberated. To time to be set free. You would think that. That Daniel, the first thing that he, he would have done was to, to get his ticket back to the holy city yeah. known as Zion of Jerusalem. Mm -hmm. To get his bus ticket, to get his airplane ticket, to pack his bags. Oh, after all, it's time. Seventy years are up. And, and, and if I believe that it's time, what I'll do is I'll, what I do is I'll pack my bags and get ready. Get ready, get ready. All right. Uh, yeah. But he didn't do that. He didn't pack his bags. He, he didn't even go to his neighbor and, and tell his neighbor, like we like to say, neighbor, oh, neighbor. <laughs> <laughs> but he did is he went to prayer. And the best way to take opportunity of a to pray, but he prayed specifically. He confessed to the master. That's it. In verse 5, he said, we have sinned and done wrong. We have been evil and have rebelled. We have turned away from your commandments and laws. As a matter of fact, most of this is a confession. Verse 6. We not listen to your servants the prophets. We didn't listen to the pastor of Bethlehem. We, we, we didn't listen to the associate minister. We didn't listen to the Sunday school teachers. We, we, we didn't listen. And it says, who spoke in your name. And parenthetically, the way that you know that uh, the difference between a false prophet and a prophet that's real is that, is that a real prophet speaks in God's name. A, a real prophet will do what Jesus does. All right. A real prophet would be more concerned about the souls of man than the materialism of this world. A real prophet will give a, 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 a message that may not get a man. You know, how many sermons have you have, have you heard any of the TV preachers, those who are being convicted and those who are not about turning from sin? Go on. Hmm. Well. All right. Let alone do a series, let alone enable them to get the word of God for free on the internet through videos or any of that. How many? And people like to put us in the same category. No, we're not in the same category. There are a lot of good preachers and prophets that are out there. And they're sharing the word of God in our culture and our time. But guess what? They are not popular. Wow. All their churches are not filled because people want to, to get the word that will itch their ears. Uh, uh, the words, these happy and positive messages. Oh, Oh, we all can be well today. <laughs> we all can be blessed today. Hello? No, we all can't be well today. That's right. <laughs> if Paul, the prophet, who wrote of most of the New Testament, couldn't be well, who am I? Who asked the Lord to take this thorn from his side, but the Lord said, my is sufficient for you then who am I if Jesus had to come and suffer in this world then who am I no the problem with those that are, are, are throwing strong stones right now is that you don't know what a true Christian is everything that says that they're a Christian is not a Christian hello 
Because Christians will try to model the lifestyle of Christ. How many jets did Jesus have? How many cars did Jesus have? How many donkeys did Jesus have? Hello? Oh, people don't like to hear this. Oh, oh you're not going to fill your church with stuff like this. <laughs> the truth. With the truth of the word of God, but yet you put men up so high on a, on a pedestal and went and be surprised when they fall down. Mm -hmm. We're all fallen. All right. Follow the, the message as long and follow the messenger as long as he's following Christ. That's it. Nobody should be coerced to do something that they don't want to do if they know this word. All right. Get into the word. That's it. That's it. And if somebody, whether a preacher or a bishop or anybody else, says different than the word, then guess what? Then it's time for you to leave. It's time for you to go. It's time for you to get up out of there. Yeah. Amen. Because if you listen to him and he's telling you to do something different than the word of God, then you just made him God when you obey him as opposed to obeying God. Well, well. Oh, somebody's doing yeah. God dirty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Somebody's doing God dirty. You're doing him dirty. Mm -hmm. You're on This was a true, true confession. This is what we all need to do because we're all doing God dirty. He said, we have not listened to your servants, the prophets who spoke in your name, our kings, our princes, and, and our fathers, and all and to all the people of the land. Yeah. Oh, it says, Lord, you are righteous, but this day we are covered with shame. The men of Judah and the people of Jerusalem and all of Israel, both near and far, and all that the countries were, we are scattered. You've scattered us because of our unfaithfulness to you. Oh, this was a true confession to the Master. And when we're doing God dirty, even in a Kairos moment, it's not time to move. It's time to confess All right. our sins unto the Lord. Well, well. Because yeah. some blessings we won't be ready for if we don't come to no, terms with this confession Amen. thing. Oh, Lord. Amen. Because there have been a lot of good folk that have, 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 have had national scandals and they started out right first. Amen. That's right. That's true. But God trusted them with something that he, he can't trust too many people with. Amen. And that's success. Because oh, <laughs> I've seen success change a man. Yes, well, sir. it will. And a man that doesn't confess his sin will believe that he's more than what he is. All right, yeah, all right, Amen. all right. Amen. That's true. He's more than what he is. And then began to act out against the things of God. Mm. The same way that David did. Oh, a man after God's own heart. Oh, what a scandal it would have been with him. Mm. And most of us would have said that you... But what we need is a spell.